Okay, hey folks, it's Owen here again, and I am on my uh, alignment game three. Uh, it's taken a while to come, really, because I've been just been quite busy. And today's been pretty mad with the summer kit earlier on this morning, and then I had a couple of hours of work to do when I got home after that. Uh, so I'm only getting onto this now, and I don't have a massive amount of time. But very important to get these games in, and um, uh, the summer kit was a lot of fun as well. I got to play Nahomec all day, and um, I got to win a nice bar zool, which was pretty cool, and some little tokens. So uh, it was very nice. I had a lot of fun. I got to play five games this guy, so that was really cool. Um, so before I get started, uh, let's go over to Planets. I'm against uh, TD Nordin. He's playing Chaplain Mavros. And we have got Iridial, Yavarn, Ferran, Barlas, and Ossus 4. So that's interesting. So let me see. It's a 3, a 3, and a red. So I think I need to be winning this number 3. Um, I need to pick my uh, dial, which I forget how to do. Uh, so let's see if I wrote it down here somewhere. And thanks to my pal here, TD Nordine, he told me exactly what to do. So it's Alt F6, and I have chosen LR. Uh, my hand is quite nice. I've got my STC. I've got a Shroud Cruiser. Uh, I've got a couple of uh, three elites. I've got my three shielder, which is also the staff. Um, I I usually don't need to use this. Uh, so I, I'm going to keep it uh, for now and just pop out a couple of these units. Um, but at the moment, we'll just stick out the STC. Keep that there nicely. Um, so the idea then would be to put out the Interceptor and the Kinsman, uh, which means we'd have a couple of units out. Uh, I probably would be able to afford the Cruiser then as well. I think the Cruiser is a good idea. I mean, it's very it's very nice being able to move the Elite around. Uh, but I might need to. Uh, I'll, I'll see how it goes. I do like to keep an extra couple of resources here and there. Um, so that's okay. I don't mind. I don't mind. It should be fun. This this guy's fun to play, and it's just nice to play a game. And and plus, I was actually thinking about uh, conceding to Mr. Nordeen, um, but I don't want to have to do that because uh, it would be kind of unfair. Um, uh, because it, well, I was looking forward to playing him, um, and I'd say he was looking forward to getting a game in as well. And so, and Oct Octagon was fucked for a couple of days, so nobody was getting any games in, you know. And we don't like that. I don't like going octagon as fucked. Cause that's shit. Um, I wonder what I'll do. I think I'll put down my interceptor at planet two. Uh, stick down the kinsman then on planet four. I'm genuinely looking to win by planet three. Me, him, me. So I would prefer to try and take these two. Um, but anyway, we'll stick this down. So we'll do this. Uh, hit that. Reduce her by two. And getting you for four is. Pretty nice. So that means we got two. Oh shit! We've only got two left. Oh, my mats, my mats have up my arse. Uh, I either put the cruiser down, ooh, and leave it. I think I'll put the cruiser down, and I'll take plans. I'll try and go hit him a two, uh, minus one off this guy, and then hit him uh, a for two. So his damage doesn't work. It doesn't work against that. Yeah, hopefully that's okay. Maybe I played that completely wrong. <laughs> we shall see. But we'll see how it goes. I might even just let him get that planet. That's probably not a great idea. I mean, well, it is only remove all damage, so like nobody really gives a shit. Uh, and it would always be nice to get your iron because I mean, it's three and it's put a unit into play for my hand, which are all pretty large units. Uh, I guess the option then is either to do the Shroud Cruiser or the Kinsman. Uh, Kinsman would mean I'm here and here, uh, but I'm on the opposite side of my win conditions, which isn't great. You'd be hitting for two, one would be gone. Uh, I don't think that would be a good idea. I'm trying to think here, really. Maybe the Cruiser would be a good idea. I think it would. I mean, I'll be bringing him over. I'd probably have to give up on this and then try and take you and you, and then it'll be going on for fucking ages. It'll be a pain in the hole. Well, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I'll do that. Uh, I, I would probably have mulliganed this hand, usually, uh, because... Well, because there's three factions there. I don't really want three in my hand. Um, but, you know, it's something that I haven't played before. Uh, what's he saying? Use Mavros ability. Oh yeah, cool. Of course, of course, a dirty Mavros. Why not? Uh, so at the beginning of the combat phase, then. Uh, oh wait, I can do that any time. Uh, it says uh, obedience, thingy bob. 
is the one I think the star is a face. Which you can move anywhere you want. Uh, so that's the adjacent planet. So that's a good place for him. Uh, mm, see, that's the thing. Venom Fiend would have been nice, but it would have been only one unit. And I would prefer to keep that for shield. I don't think I really need. Especially when you're playing elites. Uh, again, uh, which means that I am done diddly on. I have zero resources and four cards. Uh, so this should be quite interesting. Chaplain Mavros. Now I haven't played Mavros with this guy before. Uh, so he he will be different. Uh, did I play any Marines today? Uh, started off with Kith. Uh, uh, sorry, not Kith. Rackarth, who was pain in the backside as per usual. Uh, then I went on to start off against uh, was Padge who played with. Uh, Sorry, I have to pay attention to the game. Oh, he's going to way outdo me with command now. That's not so good. But, I don't mind. Uh, the only thing is, will he have drop pods? He probably will. Uh, with the pen block that he's using for a... Uh, he's done. Oh, he's using for a pal. Mavros, I would assume, would go to three. Or maybe he'll think I'm going to go to five. Take out his rogue trader. I'm going to go here and use my minus one on him and move him across and take the planet that's what I think I'm going to do so F6 and planet one and then done uh, I'm done, is he done? I have no idea he's done, cool so we need to go and flip the card. He's going to two. I'm going to one. It's okay. Smell you later. So he wins three and I win a one. I don't mind really. Although today I've been getting a whole load of cards. Ooh, Venomous Fiend. So that's quite the... And I think he's probably going to play Yvarn. He seems like a guy who will. I <laughs> hope he will. Be nice to try out a few units. Um, so we go to Planet One, and we hit him for minus one damage. Bum 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 bum. I see. That's the thing now because this is here. It'll depend what extra card I get. Extra two cards. If I get a couple of nice units, I'm good. Minus one HP. Uh. <sighs> That's a nice marker. I like that. Um, uh, so I'm going to bring you across. There we go. So I don't fancy hitting you. I fancy killing you. Let's see what he does. got seven cars he's bound to have some shields there uh, but I don't mind that's okay done and I'm done so uh, can't block the A oh he can block it but his ability doesn't but if I hit him straight it'll be three so four rather than A E two just so we know so it's three. So it's three. So anyway, we have ourselves. So what's he going to do? Yeah, that's right. Varn put a unit into play. Uh, route, discard, and take a quid. And oh, he's gone. Lovely. Uh, that's good news. So we will. Uh, I'm done. Uh, so these two guys come back with me. Uh, and remove all damage is a waste of time. So I'm going to get rid of that and take it away. Capture is a radio. So good news, we got a planet. It's always nice to have one planet. I uh, played, played my games on the large two player match today and it was really cool. Uh, it's a lovely match. And I'm good. So he's going to win that. I will trigger. 
ho, 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 ho. I fucking say you will, buddy. Ooh, very nice. Uh, I'll stick a land raider out. Thank you. Thank you very much. I prefer the land raider. I prefer these guys to be up and about doing stuff. So his brethren, sort of under the first time this unit is assigned damage this round, prevent one damage of that, and trigger the battle ability of the planet. Fucking hell, that's a pain in the hole. Like, look at this route of target non warlord unit. Jesus Christ, that's really powerful. That's like really powerful. That's fucking deadly. He's gonna definitely put this here, and hit it. This round. Wow, the, I wonder how much Unstoppable actually works. Can you keep smacking that guy? I don't think I've seen that in action, him smacking that. So that should be quite interesting. Uh, so I'm done, and we'll hit F12, and we'll fire on. So that's really interesting. I am, I don't know how I'm going to deal with that, to be honest. Uh, oh, that's okay. So we've got a pirate. We've got a fiend. Mm, that's okay. Uh, so Alt F6, and we'll change that to Chaos. Uh, that's really that's really interesting. I wonder that that's the type of thing that can, can, can completely swing a game. He's got nine resources and eight cars. That's a lot for a space marine. Uh, what's this now? This is the ancient Crozius. Uh Gains unstoppable. The first time this unit is assigned damage this round, prevent one that damage, remove one damage from this unit. That's quite good. I wonder if you could add that onto him. And can you do double unstoppable? Not sure if that works. It's only one. Fucking me, it's cheap. Although this is freaking free. Uh, so we'll we'll bang away here. Uh, we're gonna save ourselves some resources. Just about. Jeez, that's very expensive. Uh, and uh, hit this guy. Uh, hit the fiend. And uh, an interesting thing is to figure out where we're gonna send them. She's about to. Um, now, so let's see. I've got a three carter. Uh, sorry, a three. Uh, three type card. So that is worth quite a lot. He's probably going to do a barn again. Farron is not so hot. It would probably be a good idea to put him around here. I think Plan 2 is the best place for him. Let's go with Plan 2. It usually is the best place for him. Two or three. So we can go to a couple places. Uh, maybe I should have gone to here so I can sort of fling myself around a bit. But it means that if I move, I can move here and then the Shroud Cruiser can move me around. Or even if I had it here, it could have moved me a little bit further. But that's okay. Uh, if I want, I can go ding him and then ding, ding and ding him again. He's got one, he's got one. So they would both require shields. Uh, I think maybe a promoted void pirate would be a nice idea too. Uh, he has to go somewhere, so... Oh, that's a good one. Sanction sack. Fucking pain the hole. <laughs> so if I went over him, I'd hit him for two. That'd be pretty cool. Hmm, perhaps I might promote that man. Uh, we'll do a pirate first. Pirate down the end. Uh, 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 will we put it down the end? No, we won't. We'll put it here. Yeah. I think this is going to be a much tougher game. Than I was hoping for. I was hoping for a quick game. <laughs> I was hoping for a nice quick game so I can uh, get this packed up and then head off to bed soon. Um, now the question is, will I do a promotion? Shall I do a promotion? <coughs> Onto my fiend. Which will give him a win. Uh, but will I promote one of his guys? Nah, let's not do that. Let's promote the fiend. He deserves it. He's a good guy. I know I have two. Oh, I've got 
Well, I've got three out. He's minus three now. That's pretty cool. Should he be going to three rather than there? If if I really wanted, I could push the fucking limit on this and stick everything here, here. And I could probably hold out. He's hitting for five. I can block a bit. He's a flyer. I mean, why fucking not? Uh, I think so. And your play. Yeah, I know. Thank you. That's <laughs> your play. Uh, sorry, I'm waffling away here. Uh, I'm going to promote my fiend. Uh, page down. Sorry, folks. I should have really pressed page down. Uh, where is that on my keyboard? I've got a mini keyboard. It sucks. My function page down was fucking pain. Oh. <laughs> Very nice very nice that also means I'm gonna come back and blow his head off at least I hope so and I'm done oops please ignore that I had a technical difficulty Uh, so looking into this now, this is uh, pretty cool for him. This is like the opposite of what I had earlier on. I was generally getting lots of command out uh, on maybe turn one. Apart from maybe one game where I popped out a big guy. Uh, I think he was probably too large. and I probably should have mulliganed this hand. Uh, but still, fuck it. I mean, it's always a learn. A le you always learn something. So take it from a, a difficult start to see how it works. You know, it's quite interesting. It's quite interesting. Uh, uh, now the question is, do I try and go and get the first planet? I think so. He's going to the first planet. He's not going to the first planet. I'm pretty shocked by that. He has me everywhere. So, I think... He, uh, I really don't know where he's going. I have absolutely no idea where this guy is going. <sighs> I really don't. He knows where he's going. He's a smart cookie. He must be going to planet one. Must be. Oh, what has he got? F three hammers. Uh, right. Fuck it. We're going to planet one. Uh, and done. Did I say one? I did. <laughs> sort of make sure. Uh, flip the card. He's gone to one. Oh, you better believe I'm going to mobile over. So I'm taking three off him. And then he's coming over. I'd love to promote that guy. I'm coming over and he's going to hit him for three. Uh, so, uh, I win nothing, and he wins three. <laughs> he wins a lot, and I get sweet F.A. That's okay. <laughs> Shit. Okay, let's, uh, let's rock and roll, so. Targets your burn, so. So that's minus three. Uh, no, 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 no. Hang on, hang on. Oh, before that, mobile. So, so three hammers equals three damage. This is important. If he doesn't shield anything, he's fucked. He is super fucked. This thing should be dead. I know he's got seven cards, but I think it should be dead. Uh, 
and he's gonna try he will probably try and hit that for quite a lot uh, I'll let it go through for two or three. Oh shit he has fucking crushing blow yeek crushing blow crushing blow's horrible uh, but if he does I'll hit my saute complex move it across to two again and then I can do four damage to the psyker who I don't think he's gonna save but we'll see it's very interesting this, this, this is a kind of a tough start because his command is so heavy uh, but we'll see what happens it's very interesting I'd say this this guy is a good player I think everybody I've played in Conquest is good um, oh yes oh yes He's gonna trigger the planet. Oh my god, another fucking dreadnought. Oh, I got a fiend. <laughs> Elite city. Brilliant. If I could spell, it'd be even funnier. So it's three factions, baby. Which means that I'm gonna do one hit in this guy and I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'll say, ah. I only seen the one. Oh, cool. Uh, no probs. No probs. She's so different playing Noctagon after playing fucking four games today, five games today. Uh, typing away and, and talking and stuff is kind of weird. Um, so we'll get rid of that. Uh, so actions. So your action. Uh, we'll see what he does. So this guy is now down to 1 HP. Which means that between him. And he doesn't have a 3 shield. He may have an indomitable. Uh, if he does. That's okay. That's okay. That's no problem. He won't be able to kill everybody. So he's going to die. Uh, which is good. Uh, although I brought in another one of those fucking dreadnoughts. So it's not going to be so sweet as fuck. Uh, if I get the chance, though, this b this bad boy is going to go whoop over here and kill him. Um, so it's your man's action. He hasn't done anything yet. I'm not too sure what he's doing. I'm not so sure. Uh, whatever it is, his three shield is hopefully going to save my life. Because I don't think I don't think I, I didn't I didn't think I needed it at the start. I don't think I need it now. And there's a lots of elites. And I'm not too sure if he'll be able to get through them. If I can get this planet, I'm pretty sure I can get the, the next one as well. The only problem is that Dreadnought. I mean, if I hit it, he's going to do this. So if I don't get a backlash, um, someone's going for a wander. And that's not great. Thinking. Yeah, no worries, buddy. No worries. Um, I'm going to pause this for a second so you're not bored out of your nuts. Oh, sorry. Um, so let me see. But this guy has pinged Mavros, which means I think he gets damage as well. He's added a shot onto him, which means he's a fucker. Uh, so Mavros is already a two seven, which is pretty tough. Uh, deal one damage to uh, a unit control target unit gets plus one. His attachment gives him unstoppable, so not on this one. Oh. That's very nice. Motherfucking attachment. Um, so I'm done. Bum, bum, ba, dum, dum, dum. So I wonder what he's going to do. So Marvus is going to be hit once, twice, thrice. He's going to be hit once. So he's now a 3 7. I better write this shit down. Fucking hell. So he's a 3 7. 
That's not so hot. If he hits himself again, he will be a four, but he'd be a six. So he targets Marvos. What's he doing? Oh, he's a f oh shit. So he's in a four, six. That's pretty interesting. And something else has come out here. Vow of Honor. After a unit you control gets damage, takes for plus three for his next attack. Fucking hell, can you do that? That's pretty sick. So he's hitting me for how much? Now swing for seven. Holy shit. Seven on who? Jesus. That's a combo. Fantastic. <laughs> that's fucking. That's fucking shit. <laughs> Holy fuck! How many of those does he have? Give me a look at that. After a space marine unit gets new control, it takes damage. So that unit gets three plus three attack for its next combat. Holy fucking Jesus! So he's hitting me for. Ugh. So I take four damage. Well, it's a good thing I have this to fucking block some of it then, isn't it? Holy shit. That's pretty disgusting. Um, so, you have everything you need every time. Oh, here, come on. It's, it's hardly everything I need every time. And I had that for ages. I knew I'd need it eventually. Uh, so he's going to hit him. And there's only one left. And you don't have a three shielder. So what's going to happen? Please tell me you're dead. Pretty please. Hey, that's what you want to see. I always keep that. This guy is too. This guy is. This guy is too. This guy is too squishy. He is squishy. Hang on, is there a chance he might be coming in with something? There is always a chance. Um, I'm going to pull Nahumek out. Just in case. I'm really hoping. Well, you shouldn't hope. Never hope. Always have a bit of faith. In fairness, though, your dirty combo doesn't deserve it. Um, so, I'm done. Boom. Uh, it's his initiative, so he can say if he stays or not. And if not, then I'm going to use my Shroud Cruiser. decision. It doesn't matter if now I make fucks off now anyway. What do I get here now? Each unit puts a unit into play. I will not be triggering that. Not a fucking hope. Not a hope. <coughs> Fuck, maybe I should have struck with Nahumek and did two damage. Would have brought him to three. He would have thought twice about doing himself a bit of damage. I'll stay. Oh, he's got some sort of weird fucking trick here. Jesus, why does everybody have a fucking trick? Okay, Crate. So will I. 
Oh shit. I shouldn't have fucking ran off with <laughs> no mech at all. He's got some strange trick. I don't care. Uh, but it's all good. It's all good. It's good to it's good to play these guys qu a lot, so you can figure out what they do. And should I have stayed? I think leaving was probably the best idea because I mean I'm at four health. I don't want to get too milled out of it. Uh, that wouldn't be very pretty. TD Nordine is done. I am done. Uh, he's going to swing for two. Uh, targeting a plus one attack to the end of the phase. So he's got so four attack. Uh, yeah. Is it four attack? It should be two plus two. So it's two. So one, two. So we'll add the two damage on. So let's see, does he have any moves? I'd say he didn't even realize that was a flyer. I better tell him I'm done. I'm just waiting so I can use my shroud cruiser and fly over here and bombard this guy with four damage. She has flying. GG. Huh? What do you mean GG? Huh? Um. Do you want to change your targets? If you forgot, then it's only fair. I don't mind. You can change if you want. It's okay. It's only a game. Let's see if he if he changes target. I'll just say it's cool. It's cool if you do. He'd be hitting for four. Um so he'd be doing four to the fiend. Who I can't block for. So I only assume he's typing right now. So we'll see what he does. So let me see. I'm I'm I really do want to do this shroud complex and go whoop over here and blow him up. Isn't that very juvenile? I just want to do something as simple as that. <laughs> it's all just fun times. Uh, no, without be without being able to kill him outright with this swing, the game is over anyway. Oh really? Oh no, oh sugar. Oh. Well, if you're sure. Uh, GG, thanks. So that's it, game over. Oh, that's a pity. Um, well, mainly because I didn't get to use my Shroud Cruiser and blow him away. Uh, well, that's pretty cool. Wow, I can't believe I won. Uh, it, it certainly didn't look like I was going to win because of all this. It's pretty horrible. It's pretty fucking horrible. Uh, I thought I was going downhill there. Well, listen, I'm going to sign off because it's finished. Game over. No point waffling on. And li you can listen to watch and watch me type to my friend here. Bullshit. Um, so yeah, that was really cool. This is now the sixth win today with this with this deck, which is pretty cool, and I really like it. Uh, I might take out one or two cards. Uh, I have to say, props to my friend Stinger Mark II because he put me onto this, and the wife is upset for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> no probs mate <laughs> all the best all the best um, so what was I saying yeah 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 so um, Stinger Mark 2 put me onto this guy I was I was creating a couple of Nanomite decks and they were okay they were doing well uh, but then he gave me a look at what he was looking at so I took that added in two cards took away two cards and played it and it's fucking fantastic fun and it's it's really cool because you can fly around and do stuff with and it's really nice uh, but it's not oh I don't think it's really an overpowered deck because um, I think with the hand I had it was pretty h it was hard enough to win so I think I think actually him throwing out loads of units pretty much helped me I mean I have a land raiders and all sorts of stuff so it's really cool um, but anyway I'm I'm gonna sign off uh, it's been a long day 
six games in Conquest, five of them in real life, so I can't complain because uh, it's hard enough to get games uh, in real life as it is. So um, so thanks to TD Nordine and everyone I played today, and uh, thanks to you for having a look and for having a listen. So I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope we will talk to you uh, before I play game four. I would like to get another win, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, so thanks, guys. See you later.